basketball game now where UK dropped big in the polls after falling to UCLA 11 spots in all, hosting Louisville at Rupp today. Amadou Diallo slammed home the game's first points. He's going to talk about that for a few seconds afterward, too. Both to the Louisville bench and the South Blue fans in attendance. Quad A Green filmed the flow from range 13 on the day for him. 5 0 Kentucky out of the gate, but UVL storms back with the Lumino run. UK responds in a big way. Shea Gilgis Alexander for three game high 24 points, five boards, and four assists for him. SGA finding SKJ on the cut for the jam. A few technicals being distributed after this exchange. SKJ goes for eight points, four rebounds. Plenty of fuel on the fire today for the Cats, though. This the type of stuff Cal wanted to see after that loss to the Bruins. SGA Scrappy on the floor, finds P.J. Washington, who gets it over to Green. Green, the no-look dish to Diallo for the big-time dunk. 14-6 and six on the glass for him. It was all U.K. today at Rupp. Washington adding in 16-7, and 90-61. Your final here is Coach Cal after the win on the mindset moving forward. I said today before the game, we're no longer freshmen. I'm not saying it anymore. We're not freshmen now. We're 10 games in, 11 games in. We are not freshmen. And we're, the other thing I said, we got to start smashing people. When you drop 11 in the polls, losing a neutral game to UCLA, pretty good team. I, I thought we'd be out of the top 25, to be honest with you. There was a lot of hope for that. But I still told him before the game, look, I'm, we got a good team. And I'm, I'm not trading my team for any team. How about SGA? What got into the Canadian star? Most of you here don't watch the game. You're just tweeting and doing stuff. But if you happen to glance at the game, what you see on his face is a smile. That kid smiles. And I asked him after. I don't know if it's a Canadian thing. I don't know what it is. But every Canadian that I coached has fun and smiles and doesn't feel the weight of the world on them. I've got some guys still feeling the weight of the world. You could see it. They miss a shot. They shrug their shoulders. How about that UK defense holding UVL to a mere 35% from the field, 12% from three, a big improvement from giving up shots left and right to UCLA. So how did Cal feel about his team's D? We were able to go zone and man, look, most of my teams haven't been able to do this. Press a little bit play man-to-man, -man and play some zone. So we have some bullets in the gun. I mean, we, we were not stuck. Like, the start of the half, they scored three straight baskets. I said, that's it. We're going zone. So, and it looked good. Boy, the Cats came out hot, gave up that 11-0 run just like they did against UCLA, but then locked up Louisville defensively, as you just heard. So it was the battle for the Bluegrass, this uk UVL rivalry. Everything it was hyped up to be for the newest guys donning blue and white. I thought they were going to fight more, but they didn't. We just blew them out. So we came out the first punch. That was it. Second half at 10.30, I think. We just blowing them out at 30. Then we had to use kept putting the gas on. I think they tried to come out in the second half and get a run going, but defensively we shut that down and then they eventually gave up.